Welcome back, everybody, and thank you for being here, and a warm welcome from our community to all our first-time visitors. Please subscribe to the channel and like this video, and now let's get started, shall we? The tarot card of shadow is the world. Even in the shadow, the world suggests it is time to acknowledge the full spectrum and completion of your experience, the good and the challenging. The next step for you is to integrate these experiences as you prepare for the next phase of your journey. But something is amiss. You are still feeling a sense of dissatisfaction despite achievements, believing things did not end the way you wished, and now you resent moving on to the next chapter. Perhaps you are questioning the value or purpose of what you have accomplished, or you may feel disconnected from the joy that is typically associated with such a milestone. There could be an underlying feeling of isolation or alienation, as if you have completed this journey alone, or without the recognition or connection you hoped for. Reflect on whether you are truly content with where you are, or if you are merely going through the motions of what you believe should feel like success. Consider whether there are really unresolved issues, or it is just your perception which causes that shadow on your sense of completion. Now, it is important to recognize and address any lingering doubts or fears that may be holding you back from fully embracing this moment of achievement, because this card from the shadow warns against becoming trapped in a cycle of what might have been rather than what can be. The Tarot card of light is Four of Swords. This card signifies that you are in a period of recovery and rest after a time of stress or conflict. You are giving yourself the space you need to heal and regain your strength as well as reflecting on past struggles, learning from them, and allowing yourself to gather your strength before moving forward. This pause is essential for your mental well-being, and it is beneficial for you to take this time for introspection and recuperation. The light aspect of the card emphasizes the positive outcomes of such a break. You are finding the stability and peace you need to sort through your thoughts and emotions. It is a reminder that this period of stillness is not a sign of weakness, but rather a necessary step in preparing yourself for future challenges. Watch out that this restful period does not turn into stagnation. The Four of Swords in its light aspect reminds you to ensure that your period of rest does not become an escape from reality, but rather a strategic pause that revitalizes you before you re-engage with the world's demands. The messages from the universe through these cards are deeply interconnected, highlighting the necessity of a hiatus for you to truly acknowledge and understand the discontent lurking beneath your recent accomplishments. This break is crucial not just for rest, but for a profound introspection to determine why you might be feeling a lack of fulfillment despite your successes. You are asked to explore the fact that the dissatisfaction might stem from unaddressed issues or possibly from an internalized standard of what success should feel like, rather than what it actually means to you. The significance here lies in recognizing the transformative potential of this interlude, ensuring it serves as a launchpad for future endeavors and helps to correct your expectations rather than blindly following standards that do not apply to you. Thank you for listening to today's angel message, and if you liked the video and want to come back here, please subscribe to the channel, and I will see you tomorrow, my friend.